think the biggest changes I've seen in football, I think when you look on a, a football pitch now, I think, you know, you look at majority, I think, or every, um, not necessarily league clubs now, but even um, in the Northern Leagues, even in the, you know, the, um, the Premier League, the Championship, League One, League Twos, Conference Leagues, even down to grassroots um, level now. Um, you do see um, players of different nationalities, different colours, different religions. Um, and, and, and I think that's important. I think um, now we're seeing and we're a little bit more aware um, in, in regards of diversity. Um, I think we're a lot more aware of um, people's cultures um, and uh, I think we are prepared to listen and educate ourselves around that. And how like, nice is it from a personal perspective to sort of see that change obviously from going back to when you were playing it was very different and sort of seeing that now sort of that environment that footballers can come through and sort of play no matter what how nice is that to see? Yeah I think it's fantastic um, I think it's it's better for the sport. Um, I think you know you look amongst not just on the pitch but off the pitch as well. You know you look at the the supporters who actually um, come into the games now. Um, is is very diverse now, and I think it's better for the game. Um, and I think it's important that we we, we continue um, on that, shall we say, journey. And so you mentioned continuing on that journey. Um, what do you think? as a sport and sort of different sort of organisations, do you think they could sort of progress more and sort of <coughs> do more sort of thing? Well, I think they can do it, we're doing as much as we can. Um, but we all know that when you're on that journey, you're on that road, unfortunately there is one or two bumps. Um, and we do come across one or two bumps on, on, on that road. Um, and you know, we will find situations where we would have to deal with certain incidents which do happen um, and, and they'll continue happening unfortunately um, you know and it's just a case of how we actually um, deal with them situations um, and hopefully you know we fingers crossed try to iron them out and hopefully not have as many incidents happening as they are. And obviously throughout Black History Month uh, it's a great time to sort of tell people stories and sort of raise awareness but more personally what does sort of Black History Month sort of mean to you? Yeah Black History Month is, is, is huge for me but you know it's something which I've touched base on before in regards of you know it's not just I wake up 1st of October and all of a sudden oh it's Black History Month great fantastic can we do it for the whole of October come to the end of October it's November shut down that's it and it goes away you know, for me, black history is something which happens uh, in my life on a daily basis, you know, and I think it's, you know, when we say it's just black history month, I, I, you know, I, I would change that, you know, it's not just about a month. Yeah, it's great to celebrate, but we should be able to celebrate that all year round, um, not just for one month. Yeah, and um, here at the foundation, we run a, run a lot of programmes um, such as Show Racism Red Card, for example. Um, and a lot of other inclusive sort of programs that you've sort of came in and worked with in the past. Um, just how important are they to the foundation? Sort of other foundations alike. I think it's very. I think it's very important. Um, you know, and the foundation like is well highlighted. Um, and again, what a fantastic job it does. You know, and again, you've just mentioned about all the different organisations who get involved with the foundation of light. And and I think it's something which we all. With, with the partnerships we all learn of each other you know and, and again you can come down here and you'll see how diverse it is you know you've got different activities you've got different people different cultures different nationalities um, different religions who are coming in on the one roof you know um, doing different things so I think it's important and you know you've got to give a heads up for the foundation of light as well for the job they are doing in the community.